Hello everyone, welcome to another video on Obsidian. In this video, I'll talk about flitting nodes and how I take flitting nodes in Obsidian. I will share my workflow of taking flitting nodes with Obsidian. Obsidian is a game changer when it comes to node taking, but uh, one thing that it lacks is the ability to quickly jot down, jot down your ideas. If you want to uh, quickly save your idea or thought or task that you remember that you need to do, then you'll have to first open Obsidian, then you'll have to create a new node, then you'll have to write your idea. There is a lot of friction in here. That is what makes you find a better alternative than Obsidian when it comes to uh, these fleeting nodes or quick ideas that come to your mind. So before I uh, share my fleeting nodes workflow, let me uh, explain to you what fleeting nodes mean. Fleeting nodes are the quick ideas that pop into your head while you are working or while you are walking or while you are just sitting there with your phone. They can be simple tasks that you want to remember to do in the future or they can be thoughts that may help you in future in some way or they can be some ideas uh, about your work or about content creation or whatever you are doing. Flitting notes are called flitting notes for a reason. If you don't capture these ideas or if you don't capture these thoughts then they will go away quickly and often times uh, good ideas come to us at the most unexpected time. Therefore, we need a system that can help us capture these ideas and thoughts without being disturbed in our work. Now, let me share my workflow for uh, fleeting nodes in Obsidian. For that, I use the app called TickTick. Uh, that is a productivity app. And one of the features that I love about this application is uh, the quick add feature on the computer. When you have installed this TickTick app, you can use the hotkey uh, to quickly open this quick add window and you can uh, add a thought here and you can also uh, expand on this thought you see here and I don't have to uh, switch from the task that I am doing currently I just need to uh, use the hotkey it will open this quick add window and I can just click on ok and I will be able to do what I, what I was doing previously now I don't have to worry about uh, forgetting this idea or uh, forgetting the task or whatever I want to remember in the future. I can always go back to ops, uh, go back to tick tick and see that I have these ideas uh, that I had. So here is the inbox and I have this thought and I have added it here. And at the end of the day when I'm processing my tasks and planning for my day for tomorrow, I also process these notes and place them in their correct uh, location uh, through in the obsidian. I transfer these ideas uh, into obsidian if they are tasks they will sit in tick tick itself but if they are notes or thoughts then they will be moved into obsidian world in their suitable location so as you can see here are some ideas that i had and these thoughts are captured and i need to move these or process these thoughts and ideas into obsidian so this is how i capture my fleeting notes when i am working on my computer and most of the time i'm on my computer so uh, there's not a much problem but when i'm not on my computer uh, i use my phone in order to uh, save these fleeting notes or capture these fleeting notes uh, on my phone i have uh, installed this application called otter that is a, a transcription software but i don't use it for transcription rather i use for uh, recording my thoughts and ideas uh, i have placed this otter application on my home screen so that uh, I can easily open the app and start recording my ideas or thoughts that I, I can have at the any moment. I record the ideas or thoughts on my mobile application using Otter and I can always revisit those ideas uh, in the web application Otter and I will process it into Obsidian from here. So this is my second method for processing the fleeting notes when I am not on my computer but I am with my phone. And there are times when I don't have my computer neither my smartphone and at those time also I uh, get different ideas but uh, I can't capture them I don't try to dread over them I just make peace with them so this is my simple process for capturing fleeting notes I use tick ticks quick add feature uh, let me show you the settings where from where you can get this feature you can go to settings here on tick tick and you will see this option of shortcuts here and you can add this control shift a i have added this quick add shortcut and control shift as for quickly showing and hiding this app application 
and I guess some of the application productivity application that you might be using also might have this quick add feature if they are if they are available as desktop desktop application. I think uh, to do list also has this feature and many other applications also this app this quick add feature and I love this quick add feature because it allows me to quickly add my thoughts ideas or tasks or whatever I want to remember without having to switch from the task that I'm doing. This was a simple uh, method of uh, capturing fleeting notes and I hope you like this video and if you found this video helpful please don't forget to like to the channel and subscribe to the I hope you enjoyed this video and you found this video helpful and if you found this video helpful please don't forget to subscribe to the channel and like the video I will be coming with more videos on future in obsidian like this.